Oh. Ah. Na ba? Nilalamig ako ngayon. Sumasayaw na ako sa likod. Um, when I was asked to do this, I was I um, started asking the Lord, Lord, reveal it to me, please. What do you want me to say? Um, I seldom spend time reading the Bible or the things that I'm writing when I'm home. I usually read when I'm in school, every free period. And the first thing that came into my mind was, you are a movement teacher, you're a dance teacher. And God said, what is the movement says? Why is it like that? Why not on the ground? Why not patalikod? Padapa? You know? But as, as Sister Leia said, it has a meaning. When a person is lying on the bed, like you're really tired and everything, you go directly to your bed, just lay down like that, open your arms. What does it mean? Surrender. Hi, Surrender. Surrender. You're tired. Dead. He could sigh, he could say, wow, I'm done with my work, it's time to rest. Yes. The impression that came to me is that God basically, or Jesus himself, has been relieved from that human experience the pain, the sacrifices that he has to do because it has been planned. But Jesus, I believe, never imagined that that's how he would sacrifice. You know? And I said, wow, when I am, when, when there's a rain, I would go out, play with the rain, I would open my arms. You know? When, my, when I get home, my kids are going to open their arms ready to embrace me. Very significant. Second thing, why of all numbers, one to seven? Why did I pick number seven? <laughs> Denise is celebrating her seventh birthday today because she was born in the Philippines. So there is already April 9th. My marriage with my dear husband, Dennis, we are already seven years. has celebrated its seventh year. <laughs> and when I asked Dennis, can you please give me your phone? I would like to know what's the significance of seven in the Bible. A lot. Why not eight, nine, ten, seven days? And on the seventh day, that's when God rested. Hallelujah. Honestly, to be honest with you, I have not written anything. It's just a bits and pieces of everything. Just reveal it to me, Lord. Reveal it to me. Use me. I, I literally emptied my mind and my heart. Father, I love to talk. But, God is so great. He, he given me a gift of, of movement. Since I was two, I would dance. My mom would put me on the table, just dance. Dance and dance and dance. Now I'm a dance teacher. Now I'm being used by the Church of God. Amen. Amen. Using the movement to express the love that He has for us. And these are the words that this movement says. Jesus is a man of submission. When He said, Father, into Thy hands, I commit my spirit. And then he breathed his last. I am so blessed. And I'm so happy. Wow. Whenever I have problem, I just open my hand like this. Look up to him. I surrender it to you, my dear Jesus. Yes. Amen. This week, I was rained, I would say, with a lot of trials to the extent that we had a, a verbal fight in front of my kids. And my son told me, Mommy, 
I was so scared. And you were so loud. And I said, I'm so sorry. I'm hurt. But that doesn't mean that mommy doesn't love daddy or doesn't love you. It has to be done. It has to be expressed. Do I need to hide it from my kids? That's the reality. God, or Jesus, his existence, is an example of how we live our life here. Amen. Amen. Was he excused from insult? 